All right, hey everybody, how's it going? This is Paul Hostetler here, and with me is always my beloved wife, Diana. Say hi, Diana. Hello. <laughs> anyway, uh, so we are unboxing Modern Horizons. Um, have two boxes of it, so we'll unbox the other one in another video after this, part one, part two, that kind of jazz. Um, the promo this time around, the buyer box, was Flusterstorm. Uh, Non-foil, very strange. I was a little disappointed when I picked it up, but eh, whatever. Um, so for TCG player hasn't actually updated the Modern Horizons inventory yet just because it's, I guess, pre-release, pre-order, so, oh well. Uh, I'll probably be using um, StarCityGames.com pre-order prices, which are either going to be way too high or way too low or maybe exactly right, who knows. Like right now they have Flusterstorm at $19.99 for the pre-order, but on eBay right now you can find it for like 12 bucks. So, um, yeah, I guess that's... Uh, this way, so we get some light. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, here we go. <clears throat> now, I don't know how much money we're going to make on this set because a lot of it's going to be. Uh, ooh, what is going on? What is that? Magic Art Series. I don't even know what that is. What? It's very cool looking. It is cool. It. What is that? Oh my gosh, I'm completely unequipped. Ooh, full art. Uh, so, I believe every pack has a full art. Uh, 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 land, yeah. So, what they're up the front? Ice Fang Waddle. They are up front. That's bizarre. I guess that saves us some time. Ice Fang Waddle. Uh, pre-orders for um three ninety nine. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and. Throw that out there. Now, some of these uncommons are going to have maybe a dollar or two dollars a piece, too. Don't really have the time to look that up right now, but yeah. You want me to set the uncommons to the side? To set what to the side? The uh, uncommons. Oh, what are those things? Those are beautiful. Uh, Yagmoth. Thrawn Physician. Yagmoth. And by the way, the uh, uh, the lands are <clears throat> the lands are actually snow lands, which is really cool too. Let's see, Modern Horizons, um, twenty nine ninety nine. Yagmoth. <laughs> what? Okay. I anticipate that price is going to drop. If it hasn't already. But I'll uh, I'll take it. These packs are a lot easier to open. Ooh. That is very cool. What are those things? They're gorgeous. Are those... Man. That's like Wall of Swords. Ooh, foil. Foil? Silent Clearing. Oh, goodness gracious. And a Scrapyard Recombining. Right, probably combine it. Let's see. Uh, foil, silent clearing, uh, $49.99. <laughs> I love the 99s. Tells me these prices are made up. <laughs> they absolutely are. <laughs> they aren't all prices made up. Uh, oh, what, what foil the token. Pack? Foil token. It's I hard. mean, the picture itself isn't, is it? but the background there is foil. It is. The what? picture itself is not. What is even going on? I don't even know. Scrapyard recombiner. Scrapyard. This angel. Ooh. Scrapyard again. Recombiner. Uh, two ninety nine. We'll just go ahead and put three ticks for that. I'm not. I'm not gonna write that down. On thin ice is the rare thing. On thin ice. Is, uh, the artwork on this one is unsurpassed. On thin ice. Uh, $1.99. Can you, uh, you imagine a foil one of those, though? Gorgeous. Who is this? Uh, it's like Umazawa Tuei Jeet. 
GTA. The weapon is a GTA. It was a banned card. It's a banned card in modern. But they made. So that's the thing about this set is they have some uh, water love growth. Mm -hmm. They have a lot of, like a lot of callbacks. So while uh, the weapon was the card in like a couple, like a long time ago that was banned and is popular. Now they make one for like him. Uh, it's like a sorcerer in this sense. We'll be seeing it soon. Hopefully. Oh, man, I'm so. We just need to take a second to, to, to slow down. Well, uh, twenty-five ninety, yeah. twenty-four ninety-nine. So here's another one of those bird tokens, and this one is not foiled. So they are starting to foil the tokens. Hmm. That's crazy. So waterlogged rose. Uh, it's pre-ordered at twenty-five, but I'm pretty sure I've seen them for like fifteen now. Ella Damari's call. Let me, all right, let me let me just take a quick second here. To, poof. Anywho. So like I said, a lot, there's this set is straight to modern. Um, so no, so the power creep they don't have to worry about not breaking standard. Um, they have a lot of callbacks to previous sets, previous cards, previous themes. So it, there's a lot of nostalgia value uh, in this deck. As far as these art things, man, I didn't even I didn't even know these existed. And here's an here's a foiled angel token. We said the picture's not foiled. It'd be amazing if the picture were foiled. Do we want to put the uh, the foils to the side? The foiled tokens? Yes. Foil tokens. Uh, you want to just call three ninety nine. Do you want to just call? Yeah. Three ninety nine. So. Snow covered mountain. Giver of ruins. Giver of Rains. Not Rains, Rains. Mm -hmm. I read it wrong. Seven ninety nine. So should we just like divide all these prices by two? Because I have a hard time believing that these <laughs> are gonna retain that. I mean, like we saw with the waterlog growth, it was twenty five, now it was fifteen. But then you have pre-release of, like, say, a foil uh, Sarah Planeswalker card. Pre-order at $45. we are at $90 now on eBay. Pashalik Mons. Mons. Uh, let's see. Mm -hmm. What was that again? Pash? Yeah. Pashalik Mons. Uh, 250 Let's go ahead and slash. Foiled Rhino. Yeah, I gotta think these these artwork have to have value. These foil tokens have to have value. These snow covered lands have to have value. They are numbered. There's fifty four of them. I don't even know what to look them up as. I mean, they're. I really think it's a great idea. They're named and numbered Modern with the artist's Horizons name. Art series, Force of Despair. Yeah. Gorgeous. Collector Ufi? <laughs> I like it. That's the pronunciation of my name. Collector Ufi. Three ninety nine. It seems like a lot of the default pricing, I guess, for some of these rares is going to be three ninety nine. If one were to speculate on what's going to be popular or non-popular, you may be able to make a few dollars in the pre-order. Ooh, but... look at that one. This is a Lancer Sliver. That is pretty. Goblin War Party foil. Force of Rage. Force of Rage. Like I said, after pre-release prices were notoriously volatile. Force of Rage only 99 cents. Wah, wah. So numbers go up, numbers go up. Oh, that's gorgeous. Ranger Captain of Eos. I think I'm just going to have a binder with just those in it. Because I mean, I think it's just... 
That's so another much. foil. Shatter Assumptions. This is an uncommon. That one might have some more. Shatter. Can you, what's the artwork look like? Ooh, they might have some. Some value. <laughs> Shatter Assumptions. Foil. $1.99. And then Dead of Winter is your courier. Winter is coming. Yes. Maybe. Someday. <laughs> Dead of Winter, uh, two ninety nine. I would be surprised if some of these two ninety nine, three ninety nine end up being more like fifty cent rares, but we'll see. Ooh. I'm really glad we got these Femorate. boxes. These are just cool. Fraction footfall. We said we would do this quickly, but I think we're it's too busy difficult. admiring it. No, there's <laughs> too much going on. Crossing for falls, $1.99. A foil goblin token. A space pirate? No. Oh, that's a. Cisse, I think her name is. Yep. Cisse, Weatherlight Captain. Weatherlight. Back in the Urja block. Okay, I'm seeing all the same of these. Yeah, you can go ahead and collapse them. They're, they're going every time. Summer. It's Force just until we saw most of them, I figured lay them out. Force of despair. Force of despair. Uh, five nine nine. Very interesting. So one of the biggest criticisms that I heard of this set was that there's a lot more cards in here for like Commander EDH than there are for Modern, even though it's a Modern set. Uh, Laura Fawn is $19.99. Well, he is... <laughs> he is Mythic Rare. That'd be a rarity, a Mythic Rare that's actually worth it. <laughs> oh, yeah, Ooh, yeah. Look at this one. That's right. Oh, yeah. Uh, what was that? It's like Tunnel Light Mox. Mox Tantalum. It's Max Tantalum. That's what I said. <laughs> they actually had a jeweler make one of those, like a necklace with that. Nurturing Peatland. So nurturing. Nurturing Peatland. Uh, $24.99, but again, more like 15 bucks. Back. Although I imagine that will rise, as you probably won't see a reprint anytime soon. So I should probably buy all my places now that are 15. Oh, she's beautiful. Look at that. Reminds me of the uh, pre Raphaelite paintings um, Guinevere, Knighting, Lancelot, that sort of stuff. Sure. Go back. <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> no, you're right. I'm just, you're just getting a little highbrow. Genesis. It's a painting <sighs> everybody has seen. It is. But do they know it? Well, they can Google it. Genesis. This is an old And then say, oh, yeah, <laughs> I've seen they that. Did. Genesis. 99 cents. Blah, blah. I'm looking at here. It was printed in my cell. Drazi. Wait. No, no. Set, correction. Judgment. Modern Horizons. Foil Elemental here. Another sliver. Another sliver. Dirt sliver. Enduring sliver. Dirt sliver. <laughs> a foil irregular cohort. Is that a not common? Okay. Yeah, it's a common. Mist Syndicate Naga. Can't see Naga on the internet. Something you have to be careful about saying these days, yeah, apparently. Right. Mist Syndicate Naga. Ninja. Ninja Snake. Dollar forty nine. Go ahead and run that down. There's like four or five different ninjas in this set, so 
They're trying to make ninjas look funny. Royal elephant. Are you fine? What is going on there? <laughs> Magic art. Out Thrones of, of chaos. Out of context. Hall of Heliod's Generosity. Heliod's <sighs> Generosity. Uh, 999. That, that one uh, uh, brings back a chance, right? Put target enchantment card from your graveyard on top of your library. Yeah. So it might have a place in, like, say, Enduring Ideal or some sort of prison deck. Trying not to touch these full art cards very much. Thank you. Beautiful. Fingerprints are terrible. Uh, Hogak Arisen Necropolis. Hogak Arisen Necropolis. We are halfway through. Seven ninety nine. I I I'm pretty I'm very happy. Well, again, these pre order prices are not going to be. going to give us a really skewed sense of the actual value of what we pulled. But even so, so, interestingly enough, for these full art cards, I don't know that we've seen a repeat. Good. Like, all of them have been unique. That's good. Dude, riding the tick. Astral Drift. <laughs> I think there's a promo version of that one. It's like foil, and it's a uh, uh, like a Kaladesh vehicle. The so astral drift. drift. Yeah, astral it'd be drift beautiful as foil. It is dollar ninety nine. People want to make that work with some sort of flicker deck, but it, it, it's probably not going to be a thing. I mean, three mana, turn three. Uh... Ooh. What's going on with her ever dream? <laughs> a foil gluttonous slug. <laughs> Meriden the Sea. That one I'm very interested in, in working with. Meriden the Sea. Which is actually the name of a set, which is really funny. It's the same thing in the future site. They actually took some of the set names and made them cards. <laughs> Alright, that one is $2.99. Ingenious Infiltrator, or a blue skin. Lightning Skelemental. Oh, I should have written that one down. Oh, oh. too late now. I already wrote it down. Let me look at that Mirrored Embassy. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. At the beginning of your end step, draw a card, then discard a card. So 15 or more artifact cards in your graveyard, target opponent loses the game. Womp womp. So for like an eggs deck, like the old uh, um, Car Clan Ironworks, that could be a, a potential link. Lightning Skelemental. <laughs> Lightning Skelemental. Two ninety nine. Kess, Dissident Mage, Mythic Rare. Hmm. <laughs> Cast this in the age. Yeah, eight ninety nine. So yes, disappointing. That's gonna drop. I always hate it when they print like crap mythic rares. It's like, wow, this could be like a seventy dollar planeswalker, but no, it's like a, a dollar enjoy. Or maybe I'm wrong in that the pre order price is gonna actually skyrocket and be amazing. Everybody will love it forever. We'll see. Sunbaked Canyon. Sunbaked Canyon. Twenty four nine nine. So yeah, all of these. I don't know what kind of lands are calling these now. They're like, they're similar to uh, like Horizon Canyon. Horizon lands. We'll just call them Horizon. Lands. That sounds good. I'm going to run on my, my paper here. 
Bizarre trading age. Oh, I thought it was bizarre. No, it was bizarre. Bizarre. <laughs> Bear. <laughs> Urza. That's the man. That's the card we want to see. I think he's the most valuable out of the out of the whole set. Very powerful too. He's gonna see he's gonna see play modern. I guarantee. The foil first slivers chosen. That's gorgeous. First. Arch Archmage's charm. That's great. They're all great. Everything's great. So nine out of ten from the sliver. Three blue though, that's kind of hard to roll. So either you white control or purple, because then the only one's going to play that. 999. Have yet to see a repeat on these art cards. Maybe they're seated deliberately so that there is. I think one. so, like it, within this box. You yeah. get all of them? I don't know. Goblin engine. Oh, mind rake. Is it foil? No, no, no. What? Oh, gotcha. <laughs> Am I getting excited over a con? I mean, what's going on? Because I saw the art like three cards ago. <laughs> right. It doesn't look balanced. Hopefully, some new deck archetypes arise out of these prints. New ways to play, new ways to learn. Get rod monster. Okay. Foil exclude. Interesting. Oh, I like that. Very cool. Sword of Truth and Justice, Smith Grayer. Sweet. So dollar fifty on the foil. The sword, I think that's I think that's gonna have some bad. Oh wow, that is gorgeous. Look at that thing. I, they better have made an art card. I haven't seen it yet. Sort of truth and justice. The American way. Twenty-four ninety-nine on that. You get a shadow ninja. Okay. Merit Lages Slumber. <laughs> uh, Why are you laughing? Because that's the that's the throwback to Dark Depths, which is the the land where you move the snow counters and a twenty twenty flying destructible merit leash pops out and wins the legacy game for you. It's it would be modern legal if it weren't banned. <laughs> so this is kind of a nod to that. I think th this one's a lot harder to cheat out though. I think is the issue. Merit Lage of Slumber is. Oh, we get a skeletal art there. Okay. That's, that's still pretty metal. Tectonic reformation. <laughs> Tectonic reformation. Uh, four ninety nine. What's the art? Prismat Prismatic Vista. Ah, it's a, uh, a rare land. Basically, it's a fetch land for basic lands. Which is cool for thinning decks, for cards that, you know. Winds of Abandon. Winds of Abandon. 399. Let's see, no 
Sarah, no Urza yet. Urza is, is super annoying. He is the big guy, the boss. A foil illusion. Ooh. That's beautiful. Oh, I think that's a future side art. It's very beautiful. It is. Wow. A foil nimble mongoose. Ricky Tiki Tati. Reap the past. Reap the past. Nine and six. Yeah, not as far though. Yeah, it's more fun to open these and pre-release numbers. It's like, ah, oh, everything's great. <laughs> I'm so happy with my life choices. Zombra. Yavna. Which is interesting because he was like the pretty much like the boss god of the Phyrexians. During the Urza block. Oh, that's, there's a repeat there. Spiteful Slitter. Spiteful Slitter. Uh, 350. 349. <laughs> Tantalite is seventeen or nine. <laughs> foil squirrel. We got a foil squirrel. Nice. Fiery Islet. Is it Islet or Islet? Islet. Like island. You mean Island? Or Isle. You mean Isle? <laughs> <laughs> For Shizzle. So, Fiery. I like, I guess, is uh, put down for twenty nine ninety nine on pre order, so they anticipated it was going to be more valuable than the other uh, Horizon lands. We'll say. Oh my goodness! What is that? That is so cool. Woof. Dolly esque. Soul herder. Cordial vampire. So cordial. And that's the last pack of this box. Cordial vampire, dollar ninety nine. Yeah. Kind of interesting. Okay, so here is the add up, and let's go ahead and put it up a little higher so it gets in the camera. There we go. All right, let's um, add these up real quick. Your phone? No. No. We'll just do it. Okay. Uh, tell you what. Just give it. Just give me the straight number. Don't. Not, okay. Not Twenty. Even. Plus. Four. Plus. Thirty. Okay. Fifty. Okay. Twenty-five. Okay. Four. Okay. Eight. Okay. Four. Okay. Six. Okay. Twenty. Okay. Twenty-five. Okay. Ten. Okay. Eight. Okay. Three. Nine. Twenty-five. Ten. Six, twenty-five, five, four, eighteen, thirty, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, four. Plus thirty-four. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we got a total of three hundred and eighty-three. That's not including the full art lands, that's not including the uh, artwork, that's not including the foil tokens, that's not including the other foils. So we paid 190 for this box pre-ordered, and uh, yeah. If things drop at 50%, as you said, there in you price, go. That. 
Then hey, we broke even. We broke even. <laughs> but some some of it will go up. And some like of it will like go down. we said, I think these these full art cards are going to be worth something. They're beautiful. They are. I hope they're worth something. That's awesome. And, and even if not, I'm just gonna put them in a binder and look at them like every couple days or so. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Hey, thanks a lot. Have a great day. Yay. Love you, Wasi.